Pascal Struge has gutted about Harvey Elliott's horror injury. Pascal Struge has taken to social media to apologies to Harvey Elliott after he dislocated the youngster's ankle on Sunday afternoon. Elliott was injured in the 60th minute of Liverpool's clash with Leeds at Elland Road after Struge caught the 18-year-old's ankle when trying to recover the ball. Struge has said that he is gutted about the situation and that he would never wish such an injury on anyone. Struge took to Instagram to say, in today's game something happened that I would never wish on anyone. Harvey Elliott, my thoughts are with you. I'm gutted and never meant for this to happen. I wish you a speedy recovery and hope to see you back on the pitch soon. Alan Smith, broken leg and dislocated ankle, 2006, Eduardo Silva, broken leg and dislocated ankle, 2008, Andre Gomez, fractured and dislocated ankle, 2019, referee Craig Pawson initially waived for play to continue after Struge's challenge. However, the game was quickly stopped following a strong reaction from the surrounding players. Liverpool's medical team, Dr Jim Moxon and head physio Chris Morgan, were subsequently forced to take action after Elliot was heard screaming for help on the pitch. Moxon and Morgan were able to put Elliot's ankle back into place on the pitch before he was taken to hospital for further assessment. As a result, Struge was handed a red card following a lengthy VAR check that saw eight minutes of stoppage time added to the end of the game. Liverpool have since confirmed that the 18-year-old sustained a serious ankle injury and that he would be forced to undergo surgery in the coming days. Liverpool Football Club can confirm Harvey Elliott has been discharged from hospital after suffering a serious ankle injury in the game against Leeds United on Sunday, the club posted on their official website. Elliott will be required to undergo surgery in the coming days and the club will offer a further update on his prognosis in due course. Harvey, his family and Liverpool FC would like to place on record their thanks to the paramedics and all the staff at Leeds General Infirmary for the care and treatment given. According to The Athletic, it is believed Elliot will undergo surgery on Tuesday and begin the rehab process.